Well, 13 degrees today. I'm Craig Adams reporting for Maple Trust Inspections. I'm up on your roof here. You'll see this nail is just about popping out. Same with the one on the other side. Um, all these nails should not be exposed. They should have a dab of caulking on the top. So I would definitely recommend a tune-up for this roof. Uh, this roof is in great shape, but it isn't brand new and it does need a little maintenance and service to make sure it stays watertight. A um, couple other concerns here. The gutters. This one here is missing a downspout. So we should have one downspout coming down from there all the way to the one below. Um, what they've done is they've just left an opening for that water to pour through. Um, you'll see also that this flashing right there is slightly damaged. Um, it looks like it's uh, maybe a repair site and somebody was trying to bend it around that corner to keep the water out. Um, you'll see another bead of caulking right close to it. There's a couple areas where this roof has been repaired. Um, to take a closer look at what I was talking about, about a small area with a downspout missing, right here. See that hole? Water just pours right through onto the shingles below and then goes into the next gutter, ideally. But as soon as you get high volume or a little wind, that's when you start to get water going where you don't want it. Hopefully not inside. Um, another example, just on the apron venting, on this vent, you'll see another exposed nail head. So the caulking that is up here was done a while ago and it's starting to degrade. That's a regular maintenance issue. Right here, site of a previous repair, you'll see all those nails. They patched it up. Um, those nails all need a little more love, a little more caulking. Uh, last issue with the gutters, besides the downspouts that need to uh, discharge on grade four to six feet away from your house, without exception, is the slope on this gutter right here. You'll notice the water, it's just pooling. A lot of debris is accumulated there. That should be cleaned out so it doesn't start to rust through. And we should rehang the gutter just to correct the, uh, the slope on it to make sure the water's getting where it needs to go, which is away from your foundation. Um, right on the ridge here, you'll just see another exposed nail come throughout. So I recommend a roof tune-up and to take a close look at your attic and monitor it, especially after storms and rain for leaks like every homeowner should do. You gotta protect your investment that generally starts on the roof.